Now in beauty, Trudy is here with all of her know-how on taming the frizz. Morning, Trudy. Morning. First up, question, what is it that creates frizz in the first place? Couple of things. The first thing is right now, the humidity in New Zealand is terrible, 100% mm. humidity. So what happens is that your hair absorbs that moisture, the cuticle lifts and Hello, frizz. It's not body, it's frizz. It's frizz, and the hair, and that's what happens. The hair shaft actually swells and causes a frizz. Also, when your hair is colour treated, naturally dry, curly, and coarse, once you get humidity or moisture in the air, then frizz can really start to bother those sorts of hair types and, and hairstyles. Mm, which is essentially all of mine, except not that curly, but everything else? Yeah. Yes. So where do you start when you're trying to get smooth hair? You know, it actually starts in the shower. I always tell people to cool down the temperature of water when they are rinsing their hair with, or the final rinse of conditioner. Try and have it as cool as you possibly can because that helps close the hair cuticle and smooth over the hair cuticle with the conditioner. And the other thing is using products that actually helps smooth that frizz so they're high in moisture and high in an oil content that actually nourish the hair and weigh it down I mean if you've got very limp hair that can be a problem as well but you really want to just weigh down that frizz and smooth that cuticle mm. and nobody wants to have a cold shower Let's no but you don't have to you can just actually put your head back under the cool just for a second rinse it off and Invigorating. Yeah, it does work it's amazing so is it more about your hair type or is it the products helping with the sleek style? I think it's both. You know, if you've got very fine hair, don't have a lot of layering in it because that actually accentuates and ruffles up the hair cuticle and the shorter pieces tend to be more flyaway. Um, likewise, if you have curly hair, like be very careful not to have too much layering or razor cutting with curl, curly hair can really accentuate frizz. Um, and actually use products that are specific to nourishing your hair and smoothing frizz. So what are the best cuts to have for a smooth style? Look, I think if you struggle with styling your own hair, try and keep but as layer free as you can. I mean, I love layers in here. I think they look beautiful, but if you're not very good at styling your own hair, you do need to be aware of that layering needs, takes more work. You probably need to use a round brush when you blow dry. Um, definitely product to smooth it. So maybe stick to one length here rather than have it too layered. Okay, that would be simple. See, I'm very low maintenance when it comes to my hair. The less I need to do to it, the better. I think we're all like that, but you know what? We have great expectations of it looking perfect. Oh, like it looks, <laughs> I want it to look like it looks in a magazine. Exactly. So how do you prep your hair then to eliminate the frizz? Well, I like to shampoo my hair, and I don't do it every day actually. Having a little bit of natural oil in your hair is quite good at taming frizz. And re leave the towel on your head as long as you possibly can, because that'll absorb most of the moisture. And when you start to blow dry your hair, if you do blow dry your hair, don't blow the hair dryer up into your hair, because that's just lifting the hair up and accentuating the frizz. Use the nozzle to blow down onto the hair. I think making sure that you put um, your product in when your hair is almost dry, not soaking wet mm -hmm. because most people give up when their arms are in the air and they're drying their hair and it's thick and it takes forever you give up yeah. while the hair is still damp and that's why it frizzes so learning to prep the hair learning to make sure that you've taken out most of the moisture um, using a smoothing product and trying to keep heat to a minimum at this time of the year you know blow dry your hair and then maybe just try and leave it you know don't play with it too much mm. so what's your best home styling tip then I use the cold air on the hair dryer once I've dried my hair and once I've finished my blow dry I blast my hair with cold air because that again seals the cuticle and keeps your style in place for much longer. That's one thing I did know. Yeah. Although yeah, I always just get so tired. This is why I don't blow dry my hair very well, often. Well section your hair off. Most people don't do that. Like tie bits back, section them off, get some sectioning clips and just try and dry it section at a time. Okay. That sounds like a good idea. I should make more effort. And uh, it, it does take a little bit of effort. <laughs> but it, it, if you just prep it, no steps, it does work. Prep, prep, prep. So prep. what have you brought in for us to have a look at well, today? Look, there's a whole lot of things you can use, um, from sprays to gels to creams to lotions and masks. Where should so we start? Just it, let's start with a mask. I think everyone should use a smoothing hair mask once a week. And this is from a very famous brand, Moroccan Oil. Um, they probably kick-started our obsession with natural oils for the hair. Put once a week, shampoo your hair, put it on, wrap your hair in a hot towel or some Glad Wrap and then, a, and then a dry towel. Just leave it on for half an hour, rinse it off, your hair will look and feel amazing. That smells amazing. The um, obsession with sheet masks has been huge. I love a sachet mask for the hair. These are fantastic masks from Hask. They are made from Greek yogurt and they've got other oils in them and Ooh. they are a real protein shot for your hair. You know what protein does for your body? Yeah. It actually builds strength 
in your body will it build strength in your hair so they are great just to throw in your gym bag you can leave them on for 10 minutes Excellent. five dollars you know anyone can Need afford to do those. that themselves i probably bought in one of the deluxe um ranges kerastase discipline cream i like cream that says it all. Um, it's for wavy hair, so it helps smooth that wave. Again, this will be a styling product. Styling and nourishing, you'd put that through your hair after you shampoo, towel dried, and then use your blow dry or heat styling. I just like to feel you know. everything on my skin. So yeah. Sort of like... Well, it probably, probably smells a bit nicer than the Dine Kit mm. Treat. <laughs> um, That's and lovely. Then, and then this one um, is another um, fantastic new brand. Um, called 12 Reasons, and it's a new New Zealand brand actually. Oh, nice. 12 Reasons to Use It. Like, it controls the frizz, it um, helps your style last longer. So, what do you do um, with it? Stop shine. It's a serum, and we haven't talked about serums for the hair, but like you would use a serum for your skin, you would prep that after your shampoo before a styling product. And again, you can put it on dry hair. Oh, good. <laughs> or damp hair to smooth any of that frizz or in, just add a little bit of sexy, towsily separate. Sexy, towsel, I like that. Which what about this one today? here? Um, this is a whole range from Redken. It's called Frizz Dismissed Rebel Tame. This is an incredible product, my favourite. A lotion that you put in damp hair and blow dry. They have an oil, they have a shampoo and conditioner. Smoothing, it's a silicon oil mix. Um, brilliant for Ooh. thick, wavy hair. And finally this and one? And finally Kerasilk, Goldwell's new brand. Um, this contains hydrolyzed silk and it's a styling cream that you'd use on dry hair. You can't undo it. <laughs> I've got, got probably, serum all over my hands me. from the last time. Ah, here we go. <laughs> yeah. um, and it's a gorgeous cream that you would just pop through oh, the wow. ends just to smooth it. And, this, and the hydrolyzed silk gives your hair the most beautiful shine. Because that's the thing. With blonde hair, often when it's fluffy, you don't get that beautiful shine. You do not so get that beautiful like shine. So something like give you some fabulous shine to those oh, waves. Trudy, awesome to have you in, as oh, always. Thanks thank for the you. tips. Now, for more from Trudy, you can head to her website, beautyeq.co.nz. <laughs>